one instance that was critical in terms of orienting me towards Islam through a lot of stops along the way was, uh, I was at a party, uh, apologize for that. It was a Mount Pleasant housing project in New Britain, Connecticut. Mount Pleasant we call Sparkle City, but won't go into that. But when I'm leaving, it's about midnight, and this is pre-global warming, Connecticut winter, so it was cold. And this little Puerto Rican girl, the project was African-American Puerto Rican, she runs out of her house with just her pajamas, and she's screaming, why doesn't anyone love me? Why doesn't anyone love me? And the girl was maybe nine or ten years old, and I just, I just said to myself, like, no one this young should be experiencing this degree of despair and pain. So there has to be something that we can offer people like that, that we can offer children to give them hope. And that's really what catalyzed my search for that something. And it culminated with me becoming a Muslim. So that's what did it.